Nicole Winhofer is a professional dancer and trainer to Madonna, so needless to say, she's on the road a lot. Today she's going to show us a workout you can do anywhere, as long as you have a chair. All right, Nicole, what's the first move? So the first move of the chair workout is called a dip and a push back. Okay. So we're gonna place our hands flat on the seat of the chair. We're gonna walk our feet back about a foot. Good. We're gonna bend the hips down toward the chair into a plank, and then we're gonna push back into a down dog. Again, plank, oh, nice. push back into a down dog, and a plank. Push back into the down dog, and one. This is really good for the low abs, the arms, and the back. That feels great. Good stretch in the hamstrings yes. as well. The second move of the chair workout is going to be the open back. So you're gonna stand about a foot away from the seat of the chair. Okay. You're gonna reach your hands down, again, to a flat back. And the best way to get a really good stomach is rotation in the trunk. So what we're going to awesome. do is, we're going to rotate that right arm to the ceiling, pulse back. One, two, then bend twice. Rotate the torso and bend twice. Good. Two more on the right and a bend twice. Ooh. And last one, let's try the left arm. Open the left, twist. Twist feels good. Yeah, it feels so good. And down and down. Good. Nice. Getting a little bit of leg in there too, yes, which is yes. great. Multitasking. Yeah. The next move is great for the butt. We're going to take a plank position we with our like hands that. down on the seat of the chair. You're going to walk your feet back another foot so you're in a slight plank position. The first angle we're going to get to tone the butt and our lower abs is okay. parallel back. So knee up, parallel back, kicking back, lift, back, good, lift. So we're working the hamstring muscle also linearly and we're maximizing our contractions in the glute, kicking through the heel. But we're not done because there's another angle we're going to target. Nice. The top shelf of the butt. Ooh. So we're going to take that knee up and cross. Knee up, we're not done yet. We have one more angle. Oh, no. We have to have a perfect butt cheek. Yes. And we're gonna take that knee in and hit back. So we're getting that deep corner, the lower corner of the butt cheek. Think of that glute crease. And one, good job. Wow, that's excellent. And I really got my obliques yes, in that too. you did. The last move I'm gonna take you through is called step off, kick side. So we want to make sure first and foremost, most important, is that the chair is on a non-slick surface. Yes, make sure it does not slide. Yes. So we're going to step up onto the chair. We're holding onto the back of the chair for support. Okay. We're going to step off with the left. Okay. So we're going to drop down, step together. Now the right leg kicks out and back. Good. Again, kick out. So we're toning both legs, oh, both yeah. glutes simultaneously. We're getting the back of the right thigh, the top of the right butt cheek, the outer thigh. It's a really good, also high intensity cardio. Exercise, absolutely. Yeah. Thank you so much, Nicole, that was awesome. Thank you so much, and I hope all of you guys at home can please check out the Hard Candy Fitness Addicted to Sweat Dripping Wet Chair Workout. Woo, we'll see you guys next time on Fit Sugar TV.